All right. Uh, the rec starts in ten minutes. I don't have a lot of like predictions. Like we might see something for Breath of the Wild two. Then there's like nothing else that comes to my mind. It's Fifty minutes long. There has to be more than just that. <laughs> Just, yeah, I'm definitely getting a new Smash Fighter. I don't really care anymore. Like... Ever since they added Ridley and Dark Samus, I've been fine. Pico! Better put this in Neos. For me to get the maximum viewers. Unless you can't. Uh... I don't I don't know what to do for 10 minutes, but I do have a soundboard connected. That is the soundboard. I'm also on a Discord call alone. Most of my friends are either on another Discord call, waiting for the direct to happen, or doing other shit, like work. Yeah, two of them are at work right now. I'm just waiting for the Nintendo Direct to happen. i just put... There we go. Already at two viewers? Cool. Where's my mouse going on the screen? Let me go. I'm just gonna put my, transfer my video to YouTube right now. That's I forgot that one. Two years. That that's great for the start of a stream. Probably gonna have to eat during the stream, which I might miss something. I hope it's nothing important. Yeah, they are there. All right. That one public. And let's report crying in fear to you. There we go. I'm just waiting for this to to, hap to happen. Whoa, it says seven viewers on Twitch right now. But it says only two on my thing, my viewer count here. Huh. Oh, whatever. Eight minutes. Uh. I don't have a lot to talk about. I have a, I, I already said that. I have my soundboard on right now. <laughs> that one lagged. Okay. Okay, here's my favorite thing to do with the soundboard. I really love doing that. Good. Yeah, I, I looked at it. I said good. Where's my mouse?
There we go. Perfect setup. Hey, it now says six viewers. You have to wait six minutes. Probably put music while waiting. Hold on. There we go. And live. Oh, I'm a VIP on this channel, cool. Here I am, his friend, yeah. <laughs> Three minutes. Minutes. Only two minutes. Uh, where do I put this now? I'm going to do that. There we go. And I'm like, I guess I'm just gonna stay here on my in my Discord call alone. Yeah, that's accurate. All right, one minute. Oh my god, I just got three Twitch notifications on my phone. I wonder if they're going to start with Smash, or they're just going to be like, and here's one more thing, and then that's, that's Smash. <laughs> Put my Switch controller on the ground, on my bed. Mm. 
keep this there too. Starting in a couple of seconds. Oh. Hmm. Mature. This is the first direct in the 530 days. Almost a year and a half. Oh, it's Xenoblade. One day, Pyra just disappeared. tell you because Who's I you? got an invitation oh my yeah! fucking god what oh this just means that the joke I had planned out is room now I was gonna be in <laughs> just sit back and leave it to me Rex behold the power of the Aegis he looks like a Lucina clone <laughs> The joke I was gonna do is just like, you know how the Smash things like it opens in the Smash logo and then it's just a black screen. I was gonna do this. Hey, it's me, Goku. Talk about a time and I thought that would be really funny, Mithra? but I can't do that now. Let me handle this. I don't care much for Xenoblade, so this is nothing to me. I thought they were gonna end it with Smash. And no, there's. Well, I mean. They said they were gonna say stuff about Smash, but I guess that means. Uh, yeah, I will be the start of it. You can swap between each other freely. Serious fight. So it's two characters. Together. Nothing can stand our way. They always have to have one gimmick with every DLC fighter. And there's a new stage. Oh, look, our friends are here. And there's a boy. Oh my. I'll lend you a hand. Say huh, at least he, he's there. Shulk? I never expected to see you two again. Well, now that you're in Smash, I won't go easy on you. Ooh, fighting words. You forget. We're fighters too! Alright. 
don't have anything to say. Like, I really don't care about Xenoblade. Hello, everyone. It's been a while. I'm Shinya Takahashi from Nintendo. Last year, we delivered some news through a series of Nintendo Direct mini presentations. Hmm. However, we haven't been able to present a Nintendo Direct in this style for some time. About a year and a half. I'm happy to share this Nintendo Direct with you all today. We appreciate your continued support. Okay. What you just saw was the reveal trailer for the newest fighter in the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate game, Pyra and Mithra. They originally appeared in the Xenoblade Chronicles series as Rex's two-in-one ally. Please look forward to seeing their moveset in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. This fighter releases in March, so I hope you'll stay tuned just a bit longer. All right, let's continue with our first match. I still don't have the fighter pass too because I don't have enough money. All right, what? All oh, guys, I'm actually not very surprised. That's an actual good model of the Joy Cons. That's a really good model. I split Fall Guys since September. Double <laughs> greatness when Fall Guys Ultimate Knockout comes to the Nintendo Switch system summer 2021. You have 22 minutes before the solar system is destroyed. Excuse me. Venture into the vast reaches of space to uncover the secrets left behind by an ancient civilization. You have 22 minutes. <laughs> After that, the sun will explode and the solar system will be <laughs> annihilated. Jesus Christ. However, everything will reset, allowing you to continue exploring while retaining information you gathered. That's an interesting concept. By repeating these cycles, you'll gradually unravel the mysteries hidden in the universe. What messages will you discover? How can you prevent the sun from exploding? Why is the solar system trapped in an endless time loop? Hmm. Find out when the critically acclaimed Outer Wilds launches on Nintendo Switch, summer 2021. Put your sleuthing skills to the test in two classic murder mystery games. Famicom Detective Club, The Missing Heir, and Famicom Detective Club, The Girl Who Stands Behind, two deep cuts from Nintendo history, uh, are coming to ooh, North boy. America for the first time. Localized in English and modernized for the Nintendo Switch system. Suspense, drama, and twists and turns await at every corner. Eight minutes. You'll be on the edge of your seat as you dive into these deep narratives set in Japan. In one game, you'll solve a complex murder case surrounding a wealthy family in a haunted village while dealing with amnesia. The animations are good. But that's not the only case to crack. In the other game, you'll investigate a supernatural mm -hmm. rumor after a mysterious death to free students from a sinister nightmare. Interrogate suspects and hunt for clues to piece together these chilling conundrums. Can you figure out who the culprit is before it's too late? <laughs> Uncover the deadly truth in Famicom Detective Club The Missing Heir and Famicom Detective Club The Girl Who Stands Behind. Hmm. Coming to Nintendo Switch May 14th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. A new age of battles begins. Huh. What's this?
Okay. <laughs> the latest entry in the Samurai Warriors franchise Reviewers. is coming to Nintendo Switch. Dive into the history of the Sengoku period as the series now shines the spotlight on Nobunaga Oda and Mitsuhide Akechi. Character designs and visuals have been revamped for this installment. Unleash high octane moves in electrifying 1 versus 1000 battles. In Samurai Warriors 5. Slashing its way onto Nintendo Switch, summer 2021. The vast world of Fadiel beckons. After 20 long years, Legend of Mana featuring remastered HD huh. graphics is coming to Nintendo Switch. You'll set off on a journey to find the mystical mana tree seen in a dream. Before discovering the world map, is empty. During your travels, you'll acquire special items called artifacts. Place them on the map to bring towns, dungeons, and other lands to life. What? It's up to you on when and where to place artifacts, as well as how to advance the story. Join forces with characters, each on their own personal quests. Square off against fearsome monsters. Or take a break from adventure and rest up at home. The music has been rearranged for this enhanced version, and you can alternate between the new arrangement and the original soundtrack. Other features have been added, including the ability to turn off enemy encounters, as well as the new minigame, Ring Ring Land. <laughs> oh my gosh. Legend of Mana will launch on Nintendo Switch June 24th. Monster Hunter, right? I have important news. So it's finally beginning. Go assemble the villagers. Fifty years ago, Kamura Village was attacked by the Rampage and Magnum Malo. And we suffered some devastating casualties. How can we fight against that? Our hunter is about to face the biggest challenge go, yet! Go. That's a chunky guy. You can't lose this game! Pull yourself together! You're not getting in! Let's go, everyone! Go rampage somewhere else! You listen to me now! Hmm. Here it comes! Watch out for the apex! Do not let it pass! The rampage? How long do you think it's going to last? Monster Hunter Rise. Inoa, we should start preparations right away. We're here to offer assistance. We must stop the calamity! March 26th. Oh, that looks cool, actually. That too. That was the latest trailer for Monster Hunter Rise from Capcom. How will our heroes fare against these ferocious monsters? Stay tuned for the latest installment in the Monster Hunter series, launching March 26th. Next, 
please take a look at this. Hmm. Mario Golf! The fairway is open once again. Tee off on the latest installment of the I Mario saw everyone Golf talking series. about Mario Coming Golf on Nintendo Twitter today. Switch. There it Study is. The wind and terrain. HD Take grass. Your time to think things through. Then swing. Enjoy golfing with familiar Mushroom Kingdom characters on courses filled with lush, natural scenery. Bowser have pants. Use features on the greens, like a shot gauge, to see how your shot will curve due to slopes. And a scan that lets you examine a course's terrain. These features can help you ace your shots. In addition to button controls, you can also use motion controls by holding a Joy-Con controller like a golf club. Gently swing the controller to have your character swing in the game, letting you easily enjoy the sensation of I could golf. swing super hard. <laughs> oh, what? On top of all that, there are several modes with new elements that truly bring the heat to Mario Golf, including oh. this one, Speed Golf. Here, it's always your turn. Everyone oh my god. The, same time, the then golf you're battle to royale. <laughs> to reach your ball. Give it another whack to get it closer to the hole, then keep going. They made a golf battle royale. Top. Your golfing skills aren't the only things at play. Make use of dashes and special shots to beat the competition. Oh, did we mention story mode? There's a as story a mode too? You'll start out as a rookie and develop your golfing skills while interacting with various Oh, it's a story mode with your own me. Oh god, my with me is super fucked. During matches. <laughs> then allocate points to different stats, allowing you to develop your character however God, if only like. I had a gate capture. Also use your me huh. in versus play. Put your golfing skills if to the only test. Only I had Mario one, Golf a game Super capture, Rush, two, Swings money. I could do a let's play of Mario Golf with my on fucked up me. After this presentation. The latest game in the Mario Golf series adds new gameplay for multiplayer modes, as well as the familiar golf gameplay with easy to learn controls. Please look forward to this game on Nintendo Switch. I can't wait Let's to whip and they ain't more Nintendo to call. Switch headlines. Check What's out next? these games coming to Nintendo Switch. Huh. Return to the unforgiving huh. world of Pandora in Tales from the Borderlands. Play as the Hyperion Lackey, Reese, cool, and the quick-witted con artist Fiona as you set oh, out to viewers. recover a mountain of cash. Set between yeah, Borderlands viewers. 2 and 3, this game includes all five episodes filled with classic Borderlands humor. Gangsters, bandit lords, and vault hunters are just a handful of the obstacles you'll encounter in this choice-driven narrative adventure. Embark on a wild ride when Tales from the Borderlands launches on Nintendo Switch, March 24th. 32 of Capcom's most beloved arcade classics are coming to Nintendo Switch. Rewind gameplay, adjust game speed or difficulty, and select from a variety of display options to relive that sweet arcade goodness. Get 1943 The Battle of Midway for free, then purchase game packs or the standalone Ghosts and Goblins add-on to build your collection. Local co-op play is also available. Scratch that nostalgic itch when Capcom Arcade Stadium launches later today. Brains. As a zombie, you just can't get enough of it. In this action game from Aspire, you'll build your zombie horde and take revenge on the city by turning humans into your undead allies. Replenish your bodily arsenal of sputum head, gut grenades, and more during your grisly mission. This city ain't no match for a dead man. Stubbs the zombie in Rebel with Jetpack eats its way onto Nintendo Switch March 16th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Hey. It's Travis Touchdown versus Assassins. Oh. Wait, aliens? Aliens have invaded Earth. More Hold heroes, on. Is this the right game? Anyway, after annihilating an entire city, the aliens have taken over and now host an intergalactic superhero ranking tournament to decide. I need Earth's to play fate. one of these games. He's got the crass beam katana wielding got assassin Joy -Cons on his Touchdown. Hand. You'll need to fight your way to the top to save the world. Hey, 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 not so fast. To enter each boss fight, you'll have to do some odd jobs around town and earn enough to pay off the entry fee. 
you'll then face off against a slew of unusual opponents. Most of them aliens with some crazy tricks up their sleeves. Study their tactics wow. carefully to gain the upper hand in combat. With a new and improved death glove, you'll have access to a variety of deadly skills that can be customized and upgraded before each match. The fate of the world is at stake. So get ready to kick some, uh, whatever aliens have that you can kick. <laughs> anyway, it'll all make sense when No More Heroes 3 lands on Earth. Or, you know, Nintendo Switch, August 27th. Exterminate demons in he heaven. Oh. As above, so below. So below. Yep. <laughs> Why do they need assassins in heaven? <laughs> to do someone's dirty work. Hmm. Interesting. It's kill or be killed. You won't last long if you can't rely on yourself. God's judgment has nothing to do with it. Hmm. Uncover Heaven's Mysteries in Neon White, coming to Nintendo Switch, Winter 2021. The DC Superhero Girls are here to save the day. Hi, everyone. My name is Barbara Gordon. AKA Batgirl. I'm always inventing new gadgets to fight crime, like my batarangs and bat hook. This is Supergirl. She's super strong and has heat vision, plus super breath. And let's not forget Wonder Woman, an Amazonian warrior who wields the lasso of truth. Along with our friends Green Lantern, Bumblebee, and Zatanna, we fight evil supervillains to keep our city safe. But we're not just about the super life. We also have our school lives. And trust me, there's never a dull moment at Metropolis High School. Sometimes it'd be I nice forgot to this a show existed. Shopping downtown with my besties. Ooh, and maybe take some photos to share on Superstar Post while we're at it. Hey, hey, I got a comment already. Nice. Ooh, and I definitely want to hit up Sweet Justice later. Uh oh, something really bad is threatening the city. No one could have seen it. Feels coming, like we shovel where. You can count on us to answer no matter what. It just got that we shovel there shovel where energy identities. right now. DC Superhero Girls Team Power heroically soars onto Nintendo Switch June 4th. Ready the juice cannons and prepare for battle. Juice cannons. <laughs> Oh, it's Clive versus Zombies. I kind of forgot that that series had a, uh, Third person shooter. I hope this music isn't copyrighted. I feel like it is. I'm not I'm not paid anyways, I don't care. Join you in your adventure. Wait a minute. Hint, anyone can. Metopia? Band together Metopia on, on to Switch. Face evil and save faces. Oh dear God. To Nintendo Switch. Cast me characters in various roles across the kingdom. 
I will make the most fucked up army of allies, demons. Or even make someone the nefarious Dark Lord. And that will be <laughs> Peter Griffin. <laughs> Makeup has been added as a new feature in this game. Glam up your mees and get them ready for adventure. I There's hacked this game to, feature, um, to my 3DS. You go wild with your me creations Ooh. and make them even more fabulous. Cool. In the world of Metopia, relationships are key. So consider spending some quality time with allies to strengthen bonds. This can give you an advantage during battle. Again, if I had the money and if a game capture, sour, <laughs> though, <things laughs> might take a turn for the worse. <laughs> Whoa! You can have a horse as an ally? That sounds pretty barn good! Oh my god. for it, yeah. and it'll lend a hand, or poof, in battle. Venture with friends and familiar faces in the lighthearted fucking Mom horses. Utopia. Coming to Nintendo Switch May 21st. May 21st. Alright. Pre orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. I have money. Super Mario themed items are coming to your island. Super Mario oh my Brothers god, it's a Luigi. Anniversary themed items are coming to the Animal Crossing New Horizons game. Oh, they, they also ignored Waluigi. Items, Fuck! Like the Super Mushroom and the Question Block can be ordered in game as furniture items. You so just walk underneath and it. wherever you'd like. You can also place two warp pipes. Then use them to travel between locations on your island. Hey, why not try recreating the Mushroom Kingdom? A free update for the game launches February 25th. So ignored Waluigi. After downloading it, Super Mario Brothers items will be available via Nook Shopping starting March 1st. Oh my God! There's not a single Keep an eye Waluigi on the official thing. Animal Crossing Twitter account for the latest information. Twitter will be mad. <laughs> <laughs> we hope you continue enjoying life on your island. How was that? These collaboration items will be released as part of the Super Mario Brothers 35th anniversary events. Please wait a bit longer for their release. Speaking of which, last week, we had the global launch for the Super Mario 3D hmm. World plus Bowser's Fury game. We hope you enjoy that Mario adventure as well. Next, as we have well. another game to show you. What the fuck is that word? He leaves us no recourse. Swords. Never. Oh wait, it's uh, one of those games. Fuck, what are they called? Are these the wages of loyalty? Raised earth and burnt corpses. You and no other must decide how we proceed. You are a leader and must be the beacon others look to when the night is darkest. Together with these fields, today you burn. what this is called. I promise to do all in my power to see us through this safely, every last one of us. Oh, this one's called Triangle Strategy. Far, far away lies the, the Oh yeah, the other one was Octopath. There we comprised go. Comprised of three nations and limited deposits of salt and iron. The constant feuds among the nations over these precious resources eventually hmm. ignited into a great conflict known as the Salt Iron War. Though the hostilities ceased with an uneasy truce, decades later the flames of war threatened to engulf the realm once again. You are all that remains. Caught in a tangled, fiery web of plots and conspiracies, a brave group from Glenbrook fights to save their kingdom from the powers that would orchestrate their downfall. Love because of uh, it's, it's the say. Nintendo YouTube account. There's just Mario in the corner. 
In this new tactical RPG, battles take place on terrain with different elevations. A character's attack More in the corner range is determined someone fucking by their dies. location and their equipped weapon. The range can be extended by attacking from higher ground with long-range weapons, such as bows and arrows. Thus, your forces can use the terrain and other elements to gain the upper hand. An enemy outflanked is susceptible not only to your initial attack, but also a powerful blow from the ally positioned behind the enemy. What have we here? Charge into an enemy to send them flying into position for a follow-up attack. We win. Link attacks together by first casting ice magic on the flames to create water terrain. Then huh. electrify the area with lightning magic. One way it to is do of it. the utmost importance to survey the battlefield before taking action. Throughout the story, you will be faced with making important decisions in a variety of situations. Utility, morality, liberty. Collectively, your decisions will establish your conviction, affecting how the story unfolds and who will join your cause. Once more, I would ask you plainly, do we or don't we relinquish Prince Roland to Estrost? This is a long Discord call right now. Critical decisions that may determine the fates of nations are settled by vote on the scales of conviction. <sighs> Use information you've gathered to sway allies toward your favored cause. The story will significantly change based on how the votes are cast. So they refuse to relinquish him to us. Lies! His hand was forced! As more and more critical decisions are made, your journey may take you down paths divergent from those of other players. You will see what true might is! Project Triangle Strategy, a brand new tactical RPG from Square Enix, will launch ah, in wow. 2022. Please be on the lookout for more information in the future. After Don't this really presentation, a demo. demo version of this game will be available to download on Nintendo eShop. And in the future, we'll conduct a survey to gather player feedback. We look forward to hearing your responses on the demo. Please look forward to future updates on this brand new tactical RPG from Square Enix. Okay, let's see a few more Nintendo Switch headlines. Calling all hunters. Do you have what it takes? Yeah, it is a flawless thing. Oh. Oh, that was not good. Star Wars Hunters is a competitive, free-to-play online game set between Episodes 6 and 7. Clash in this third-person shooter coming to Nintendo Switch in 2021. All right, let's do this. All right, so... God damn it. <coughs> do I look at you or the camera? Knockout City Interviews, take one. We all play for different reasons. Mm -hmm. Gorgon love battle. Gorgon use many weapons. Triple-bladed war axe, spear of misery, Hades soul-devouring crossbow. A princess is supposed to lead her people, not be stuck up in some tower waiting for a hero. My line of work? Bullets are constantly whizzing past you. Flaming longsword, blade of doom. Just once. Just once oh, I'd viewers. like to catch one of them bullets. You know, with my hands. With this crown, I'm gonna lead my team to victory and kick some serious ass. <laughs> Look, it's simple. Corgan want new weapon. In Knockout City, I'm like a kung fu master. I can catch bullets. Come get some. What type of fucking announcement is this? Oh, it's is it? it oh, it's professional dodgeball. <laughs> Be the ball. Be the ball. Catch me. 
It's professional dodgeball. <laughs> the fight for survival starts now. Hang on tight, because you're all going to play a little game of fate for me. From the creators of the Danganronpa and Zero Escape series comes a fight for your life. Thought this star was familiar. Disoriented and trapped in an underwater theme park, the 12 of you, known as the Go-Getters Club, must now survive also looks this like the game of fate. Pokemon art cars. style. <laughs> scare you all but the game is canceled the game is suddenly called off you escape the theme park and get a glimpse of japan but everyone's vanished set off on a captivating journey across the country that blends side-scrolling action with suspenseful narrative the one behind the whole game of fate. it's straight up As the you make pokemon your way back art home style to tokyo You'll alternate between working solo and teaming up with the group to overcome challenges and monsters that stand in your way. What awaits you all at the end of your journey? The That's battle a for survival <laughs> begins in World's End Club, venturing onto Nintendo Switch, May 28th. Wield the powers of Olympus with the physical release of Hades. This game's getting Hades, a physical release. The critically acclaimed dungeon crawler and recipient of multiple Game of the Year awards is getting a physical release on Nintendo Switch. This version comes with a couple of extras to assist you on your journey out of the underworld. The first is a PC download code for the Hades original soundtrack. Huh. It's packed with two and a half hours of blood pumping music composed by Darren Korb, known for his work on previous Supergiant titles like Transistor and Bastion. The second is a 32-page full-color character compendium featuring portraits of the game's vibrant cast of gods, ghosts, and monsters all by Supergiant's art director, Gen Z. And let's not forget the game itself, offering dozens of hours of exhilarating action paired with a compelling story. Escape the underworld again, or for the first time, with the physical version of Hades on March 19th. Three deadly action games, one masterful collection. Alright, that's, that's Ninja Gaiden, right? It is. Ninja Gaiden Sigma. Ninja Gaiden Sigma 2. Ninja and Gaiden Ninja Sigma Gaiden 3, Razor's Edge <laughs> are coming to Nintendo Switch as the action packed Ninja Gaiden Master Collection. You are the legendary ninja Ryu Hayabusa, fighting against a great evil with battle skills that are second to none. Wield an arsenal of killer weapons, each offering a playstyle with a different set of lethal skills, along with ruthless ninjutsu to swiftly take down enemies. Quickly gauge your opponent's movements while unleashing fast and frenzied combos, and team up with other super ninjas in your quest to fulfill your destiny. All previous downloadable content, including costumes and game modes, are included. Revel in the intensity of Ninja Gaiden in one dynamic collection. Ninja Gaiden Master Collection slices its way onto Nintendo Switch Summer 2021. For viewers. More battles are coming DLC? to Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. Huh. Hmm. We're getting an expansion pass. New weapon and costume for Link. That's the first thing coming out. There's Ooh. even more coming to Nintendo Switch. Oh. Bravely Default 2 is almost here. 
four heroes of light will soon embark on a journey to restore the crystals. Use the job system to develop your characters and master the brave and default commands to emerge victorious in turn-based battles. I need to fight. Veterans and newcomers to the series can enjoy this brand new story on February 26th. A new trailer for Bravely Default 2 will be revealed following this presentation. I saw the hair the game can clip be pre-ordered on Nintendo character's Wii neck. An updated demo is also available. The latest installment in the legendary Ghosts and Goblins series comes to life. As the brave knight Arthur, you'll unleash weapons, spells, and skills to battle monsters across challenging stages within the demon realm. Local co-op play is also available for the first time. Help Arthur in his quest with one of three supporting characters. Barry for defense, Carry for transportation, or Archie for bridges. Ghosts and Goblins <laughs> Resurrection launches February 25th. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. Eight protagonists, eight captivating journeys. Saga Frontier has been remastered for Nintendo Switch. Travel through a stunning sci-fi world with any of the protagonists, each with their own stories. With the addition of the playable protagonist Fuse, new gameplay features, exhilarating battles, and a new scenario for the protagonist Acellus, Saga Frontier Remastered is an adventure not to be missed. The game launches April 15th. Apex Legends is storming onto the Nintendo Switch system. Mm. This free-to-play battle royale features a growing roster of powerful contenders named Legends, strategic combat, cross-platform play, and more. All players on Nintendo Switch can get an all-new Legendary Pathfinder skin and 30 free levels for the Season 8 Mayhem Battle Pass. Plus, for the first two weeks after launch, earn double XP when you play on Nintendo Switch. Fight for fortune, fame, and glory when Apex Legends enters the fray March 9th. How's it going so far? There's still a little bit more to show you in today's Nintendo mm. Direct, so we hope you'll stick with us. But Next, there's about 10 minutes let's take left. a look at this. What, what is this? Hello there, I'm Eiji Aonuma, producer of the Legend of Zelda Are series. We, Breath of the Wild 2? I'm sure a lot of you saw me and thought there might be news about the sequel to the Legend of Zelda oh, Breath of the Wild game. Unfortunately, we don't have anything to share right now. Damn it. We apologize. Development is proceeding smoothly, and we should be able to bring you some new information this year. Oh. For now, we'll have to ask you to wait just a bit longer. While you're all waiting, however, this Legend of Zelda game will be coming to Nintendo Switch. Please take a look. Hmm. Is it a remake? Is Tower with Sword? Huh. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay, that, that book. Yeah. Skyward Sword is coming to Switch, huh? It looks good. I don't think they have changed the model, but still. Skyward Sword for Switch. What you've just seen is The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. This game originally released in 2011 on the Wii console and it's now 10 it's years coming old? to Nintendo Switch. The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword featured a control scheme in which players would use the Wii Remote Plus controller as a sword and the left Joy Con as a shield, shield and right with Joy the increased the processing sword. power of the Nintendo Switch system. The controls here are smoother and even more intuitive. Hmm. And we've recreated the controls for the sword and the shield here by having the player hold two Joy Con controllers. The Joy Con controller in your right hand is the sword. Swing it to have Link swing his sword in the game. The Joy-Con controller in your left hand is the shield. By lifting the controller, you can raise the shield to block enemy attacks. You can perform other actions like using both controllers to wield a bow and arrow. These physical movements add a sense of urgency and tension to combat. But we've also made it possible to play the game with button controls to ensure it can be played in handheld mode or on the Nintendo Switch Lite system. After mulling over how to assign different gameplay elements to different buttons, 
we decided to apply the sword motions to tilting the right control stick. That's fair. Tilt the stick down when you want to swing the sword downward. To swing to the right, to the left, or diagonally, just tilt the stick in the respective direction. It's, it'll be weird having to swing a sword with Here's something else we've been the working right on. controller. The right joystick. Specially oh. designed Joy-Con controllers. Don't the right Joy-Con cool. controller is themed after the Master Sword, while the left features a Hylian shield motif. The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword, as the game depicting the earliest story in the Legend of Zelda timeline, details the events around the creation of the <laughs> Master Sword itself. Yeah. We hope that people who played the original game on Wii, and those playing it for the first time, will enjoy discovering the origins of the Legend of Zelda. The Legend 16. of Zelda Skyward Sword HD launches July 16th. Following this Nintendo Direct, you'll be able to pre-order the game on Nintendo eShop. Hmm. And the specially designed Joy-Con controllers will launch on the game's release date at your local retailers. Many of you may already know this, but The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword was the last original console game prior to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild game, and it was still following the established conventions of The Legend of Zelda. However, it gave a glimpse into many features and innovations that would eventually be adopted in The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Using the sailcloth to descend in midair, a stamina gauge that depleted as you scaled walls with vines or ran. Even the concept of collecting items to upgrade gear. I hope well, those of you Texas who played The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild will give this game a try as well. Please look forward to The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. Well, what did you think? Five the Legend left. of Zelda Skyward Sword has been optimized for Nintendo Switch. It includes intuitive motion controls and button controls by tilting the right control stick. Okay, the next game will be our last announcement for today. Please take a look at this. Uh, what is it? What do you have to show me, Mr. Nintendo? Platoon? Oh my god, that's the Eiffel Tower. Oh my god, that fish! Platoon 3. <laughs> Let's 
also been to like only like three years old. Maybe four. 2022. What you've just seen is the latest installment in the Splatoon series, Splatoon 3. This game is scheduled to launch in 2022, so it'll be a while. We hope you'll stay tuned for more information at a later time. Today, we showed you a sampling of games coming to Nintendo Switch. A variety of games are in development. And we look forward to sharing more news with you in the future. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Thank you for watching. Hmm. That's it. Not really anything I cared about there. Wow. I guess there's only Mario Golf. I guess that's gonna be that's gonna be it for the stream. I stream every Sunday and Wednesday. I have no words to say. Just actually, hold on. Let me raid. If uh, OBS didn't freeze, no wrong person. No wrong. God damn it. The two underscore. Oh, let me. Two underscore. There we go. Right person. Yeah. <laughs>